This is how I tie my running shoes for a more comfortable and safer run. If you are a beginner runner like me, a seasoned runner, or an avid walker, I will teach you a game-changing way of tying your running shoes so you can try it too. I learned this when I went to a running store and I was trying on different shoes. Unfortunately, none of them were working for me. Some didn't fit well and are slipping, but all of them were loose at the Achilles area. The very nice lady at the shoe store noticed that I have a very narrow Achilles and showed me how I can effectively tie my running shoes and it has been a game changer ever since. The good thing about tying your shoes this way is once you've done it, you don't have to go through all of the steps every time. And you can just tie your shoes like you normally would. I'll show you what I mean. First, you have to make sure your laces are tight. Second, make a bunny ear by putting in your shoelace through the last eyelet of your shoe on the same side. Do this on both sides. Third, grab the laces and put them through each opposite bunny ear or hole. Fourth, pull, 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 like a little tug of war. You want this bunny ear to be tight in this area. Lastly, do your favorite knot. I just do an ordinary knot twice to be extra secure. Wasn't that easy? I'll show it to you again. While you're watching that, for those who are new to my channel, this channel is for charity. Everything that I will earn from this channel once I get monetized will be donated to a charity organization. Like what I have told you earlier, once you have set up everything, you don't have to go through all of those steps all the time. You can just take out your shoes and this will stay in place. Once you're ready to use your shoes again, just put in your feet, adjust the laces a little bit to tighten it, and make your normal knot or knots to secure it. And you're done! Let me know how you tie your shoes, and I genuinely want to learn tips and tricks from you. Leave a comment down below so we can all learn from each other.